Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and today I'm going to be doing another episode of NASCAR Talk, and today's a special episode, but um, we're just going to get right into what we normally do. So, the past two weeks I've missed, so we're going to talk about Darlington, and specifically the Xfinity series for now. Um, we had some crazy wrecks, a little little bit of air in, an, in a, in a wreck under caution. So that was pretty crazy. Um, then for the battle for the win, it was the nine, the two, who man was close, and the five, or the seventeen. I'm thinking cup, but the seventeen, uh, which was Larson at the time, in the Xfinity series, and um, he. So it was the nine and the two for first and second. And the 9 and the 2 and the 17, they all get into the wall, but the 9 is able to come off of the wall. As both the 17 and 2 are riding the wall. And the 9 smooths, smooth sails to victory. There were a couple of other little crashes, but I'm not going to get into too many details. Um, and then the Cup Series race, we had lots of playoff driver craziness. Um, specifically with... Um, the 9 and the 14, when they got in their wreck, it was the 9, just got loose, and came back up on track, and hit the 14, or the 14 hit him, and, um, yeah, that was pretty early caution, and then, on a late race, what was going to be a late race restart, um, I do believe the 11, at Darling, or, this is at Darlington still, I do believe that the 11 had a pit road penalty from the lead. The 18 then blew an engine from the lead. And this was under caution. He blew an engine under caution from the lead. And then 43 took over the lead and went on to win the race. Now we get to Kansas. As Don't quote me on this, but I believe the 4 won the truck series. Uh, I've got no clue who won the Xfinity series. I mean, I just don't remember. Um, and then the Cup series. So, early accident when two cars crossed the nose of the four. He got loose and wrecked off of turn four. And that ended his, ended his day. Then we had the what the broadcasters said big one. But it was just like a 3-4 car crash, and it wasn't even that much, that bad. Um, so it was the 21, the 7, the 10, and I believe the 6 was involved. The 47 had something to do with probably spinning them. But yeah, it wasn't that big. Just a couple of hits on the outside wall, a couple of, um, yeah, just a couple of hits. And then the winner, Kurt Busch. So, that is his second career win in the Cup Series, and he is a non-playoff driver, which Eric Jones is also a non-playoff driver, which means that his two non-playoff drivers so far that um, have uh, won, the 43 and the 45. Um, so, the 45 sweeps both of the Kansases this year. Um, with two different drivers. Um, Kyle Busch is finally signed with RCR. Not surprised at all. He's going to be driving the number 8 car with a similar paint scheme. Um, and, uh, yeah, just, just very good for Kyle Busch. I'm very glad he finally got signed. And... Yeah, that, that's that's pretty good. And the schedule changes came out for all three series. I'm not going to get into that because it's not much. And then, you know, Will Cabral, um, Chicago Street Course. Um, yeah, so. Now let's get into the tier maker, which you can see on your screen and in the title of the video. <laughs> so, uh, I'm going to be predicting the rest of the playoffs so i'm just going to predict who gets out in the round of 16 12 8 and 4 well i i'll get i guess i will do champion 
So, yeah, whatever. Okay, here we go. So, I think who's going to get eliminated in the round of 16? I, I'm, I'm thinking Dylan. I don't think he's going to make it much farther than the round of 16. Um, now this is, I don't know. I think, I think Reddick's going to be out. There's no road course until, uh, the Charlotte Roval, so I think both of the RCR guys are out, um, just because I don't, I just don't, I just don't see it. I just don't see it happening for them too. Um, I, I personally like Christopher Bell, but I don't think he's gonna make it past the round of sixteen. Maybe, and then he'll get dropped off in the round of twelve. So I'm not gonna put him in yet. Um, oh man, this is this is some good drivers, so it's pretty hard. I'm thinking Suarez, uh, I'm thinking he's not going to make the round of 12. And one more driver, and that one driver is going to be the number one. I, I, he's had a great season so far, made a couple of guys mad, and I don't think they're going to let him advance. So, and it's Bristol short track racing for the cutoff, so if they can do anything about it. He's not advancing, and that's what I believe is going to happen. <laughs> so now round of 12, like I said, I believe the 20 is going to miss the round of 8. Um, I believe that the 48 is also going to be out. The 18, which is a... Oh my goodness, why do I get The 18, which is a former champion. I don't think he'll be making it to the round of 8. Um, and Austin Sindrick. I think he's going to be out there. Now in the round of eight, I don't think the 14 is going to make it that far. Nor do I think the nine. The, tw the 12. Okay, why is this happening? Yeah, I don't think the 12 is going to make it as far. Now I'm going to keep the nine there, but the 24, I'm not thinking this is his season. And for the championship four... I really think it's going to be the same as last year. I really do believe that it's going to be the same as yeah, last year. Now here's the deciding. The 11's never won a championship. The 9 and the 5 were the most recent champions. I don't think the 5 is going to be the champion. Nope, I don't. I would love... To have the twenty two go to the or be the champion. But I don't think it's happening. He's he has won a championship before, but I don't think it's happening. Now I think that the nine also oh my goodness. Is gonna be the champion. I believe that the 9 is going to be your 2022 season champion. Those are what I believe. So, um, I hope you guys enjoy. Um, yeah. Um, if you like this, make sure to like and subscribe. And if you do or don't, <laughs> I'll still be um, ranking my favorite Cup Series drivers. Probably in under five minutes. And I will see you guys next time uh, for the next video of NASCAR Talk.